Good evening, I'm Hannah Bueller. There is a new layer in the effort to clean up a body of water that has faced a host of challenges over the years. The state DEC was at Skijakwita Creek on Friday to keep coal tar and other dangerous materials from spilling into the lower section there. Jefferson reports on why this little body of water means so much to Western New York and some of the other steps to keep the creek clean. Skijakwita Creek is important because it's got a lot of history. Restoring Skijakwita Creek. It has been a focus for Buffalo Niagara Waterkeeper for close to two decades and impacts many of our communities. Skijakwita Creek is a 13 mile stream and it stretches from the headwaters in Lancaster through Depew, Cheektowaga and the city of Buffalo and eventually connects with the Black Rock Canal which feeds into the Niagara River. Jill Jedlica is executive director. Everything that happened to Skijakwita as a creek system was intentional. It's how people decided in the previous generations over 100 years how to utilize, exploit, and even abuse the system. Sewage overflows, stormwater runoff, and years of industrial pollution continue to be major challenges. Just last week, the DEC announced an emergency cleanup of coal tar and other hazardous substances found in the water. Anytime you're dealing with industrial contamination, it's it's significant because and the, and the type of contamination that we're seeing there um, does pose a human health risk. So that's why it kind of ratchets up the attention. Even with setbacks, progress along the Skijakwita is easy to spot, including the restored wetlands habitat on a stretch of the creek that runs through Forest Lawn Cemetery in Buffalo. Where we're sitting right now actually used to be all mowed cut lawn. That's all it was. What our team did was design a system to work with nature. So there's some natural spring water that actually feeds underneath the ground here in Forest Lawn Cemetery. And we created pathways for that natural spring water to collect and then reconnect to the creek. And Buffalo Niagara Waterkeeper is inviting you to get involved with a month-long initiative called Skijakwita September. You can take part in cleanup efforts, a scavenger hunt, and even enjoy lunch and learning activities. What's the hope overall for Skijakwita? Right. What are you working for for the future? Sure. Our hope and really what is core to Waterkeeper's mission is that someday we hope that our community will have restored and clean waterways that nobody has to worry anymore about what's in our water. Jeff Russo, 7 News.